I mean, think Lower your weapon. Hi. Put your gun away. Push Y. Y doesn't do anything. It X. reloads. X doesn't do anything. L. Oh god, I'm getting shot. L is zoom. B? I don't fucking know. B uh, is dispossess. Right. I wonder if the game fucks up and goes back to full health. Nope, okay, some internal consistency. Are you spooked? This is the most effective haunting ever because it involves bullets. Yeah, everything dies in two bullets or one to the head. Except you, you're some sort of Uber You're about to die. Yep. Or go for a swim. <laughs> Maybe both. Oh. Yeah, alright, go find a new host. With the most for your ghost. Oh, there's actually my. <laughs> you saw that, right? Oh, oh god, there, it's. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh -huh. Is that the corpse? It's the shadow. Hey! Oh, fuck. Alright, this might prove. Oh, that dude's spooked. Are you spooked? It's pretty spooked. Probably because I shot at him. Yeah, probably. Haha! Uh -huh. Sucks to be you. Yeah, that'll show that ghost. We're just gonna shoot his host. Hi, dog. Just ignore me. Alright, I don't have to shoot the dog. Oh, Jesus! Okay. Yeah, the dog seems pretty non pulsed. Non plussed, whatever the fuck it is. Dog doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, fuck. That's a dog. Hi, doggo. He gives me a red red. Time. He's not nipping at you. Heal boxes! Ah! <laughs> Wait, so why was that one guy shooting at me and the other dude just standing there? That other other than because this game mamba. is bad. And all the dog will really do is kind of tense up and not do anything. Dog's like, yo, there's a ghost there. Yeah. And if you choose the, to do the, nothing about it, that's your problem. Yeah, the dog is just like, yeah, I don't know, he's a ghost. What do you want me to do? Fight him? He's just gonna get a new body. See, the dog understands the futility of fighting the ghost, yes. unlike the humans. You can't kill what is already dead. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Just kill this body? Fuck you, it's your friend. I'm your friend now. <laughs> I am Frank. Oh, man. Um, I remember one time in this, uh, RPG, I was playing as a monster made entirely out of goo, uh, who didn't quite understand how humans worked. And at one point, I killed, like, this high-profile scientist, and, uh, my plan for infiltration consisted of skinning him and then wearing his skin as a suit and just walking in. It was amazing. How did that work? Uh, it I think those are going to explore. Yeah. Well, that solved the problem. It did. Yeah, I would imagine just this goo monster without bones walking around like a human wouldn't work great. Yep. Uh, so I, I was basically Ugh. slithering around. I keep pressing B thinking that's reload for some reason. Mm, I'm not even sure what game had that as B reload. I think time splitters. Yeah, maybe. This game seems time splitter esque. Except bad. Yeah. The writing's not good. There aren't interesting characters. The controls are all janked as fuck. Um, I don't care about the story. Uh, there's no monkeys. Uh, <laughs> there's no lasers with bullets that bounce off the walls. Yeah. I don't want to give this I'm just gonna list all the reasons possess. Time Splitters is better than this. Can tell the situation. This dude is huge. Huge. I don't think I have a copy of it. I will find a copy. I'm sure there is a used game store downtown that has a copy of Time Splitters too. Well. That was stupid. <laughs> Shoot him. I am. Jesus Christ, he has a lot of health. His shield is up, I think, is the problem. No, it's not. I was dealing damage. And he right. appears to shoot slow-moving lasers. Interesting. Maybe they're like anti-ghost bullets. Yeah, that stands up to screen. Are you spooked yet? Are, are you spooked by the ghost? They're shooting at you? Just throw smoke grenades. Thank you. I 
wonder if the smoke does something. He has a lot of health. You have infinite bullets, what's it matter? That's true. I, I have an infinite amount of time, but my patience wanes then. Okay, no, I don't think you were doing damage to him, because when you were shooting him in the back, you actually did a lot more damage. Shoot him like a coward. In the back. Yeah. You're bad at this. Me or him? Yeah, both. <laughs> I think that's a fair statement to make. <laughs> you ever wondered what a gunfight between two incompetent idiots would look like? I think a lot like this. You'd also see it in Deus Ex a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Why is that guy still running around while the other dude's in the vent? <laughs> he clearly couldn't have left the room. Why haven't you left? Why haven't? Why have you left your alert state? Uh, maybe he went home. <laughs> maybe he went home. <laughs> Man, if I was actually an infiltrator... Go behind him and shoot him in the back. That is exactly what I would oh, do. Oh, okay, I see. I would do that so often, I, I would, like, set off an alarm midway through the, uh, complex, and then just leave, and do that every day, until they got so inured by it that they no longer cared when the alarm went off. And but he's I... like this, just go up and shoot him a bit, because it... I don't know what's going on. Can I just shoot him over the sh- no? Okay. I am unclear when we can hurt him. God damn it, Cord. Just, just die. This is the most flaccid and boring gunfight I have ever seen. How many bullets can you soak? What kind of ubermensch cyborg are you? Well, he's only soaking about half of the bullets, because oh, that did some damage. Oh fuck, I'm dying! Okay. okay, yeah, that's the gimmick. His gun does a lot of damage. It's just really slow. No, I think it was the grenade that did a shitload of damage. Well, he shot you once in the face. Okay, so I should keep my distance because those slow-moving plasma bursts are super deadly. It's like Fallout. Yeah, I never understood why plasma was so goddamn slow. Like, we can accelerate bullets, but not, like, super hot plasma. Just die, fuck. Look, one of us is immortal. Just, just accept well, it. Well... Yeah, shit, it's the grenades. No, I think those are anti-ghost weapons. Because you're dead. Am I dead dead? Or Looks is, like it. Like, the, fuck. Mission failed, no host available. Restart level? Well, that's unfortunate. Save your progress. Ooh, boy. Uh, Aren't you spooked? I'm not spooked. I'm decidedly unrustled. Uh, I don't know, you seem pretty rustled, just not spooked. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm only rustled by bad game design, not, not by spookitude. Spookitarium? My spook Spookosity. levels are dangerously low. Yeah, this my, is... My, my, okay, good. My annoyance at terrible load times and bad game design, yeah, however, yeah, is at an all-time high. At I kind of want to see what... Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Get body. Okay. <laughs> I kind of want to see what this guy looks like when he dies. So... Oh, maybe you can possess the grenades and make them explode while he's like this. Dispossess... Grenade. I can move around as the grenade. Yeah, duh, because you're a ghost. That's amazing. Okay, so... That explains a lot, because now this bot... Like, look at how much health he lost. Yep. Okay, he dropped another grenade. Go, 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 go. Dispossess. Wow, you're bad at... You are bad at this, Mr. Cord guy. This is a weird gimmick. Yeah, it works, though. What was your plan, sir? Well, my initial plan was just to shoot him over. No, I mean that guy. Oh. Yeah, he takes a shitload of damage now. How do I break his shield? Grenades? With the grenades. Oh, get out of here! I realized this was a stupid idea. Yeah, but I, I mean, like, okay, let's assume those are fragmentation grenades, which is the most likely thing. Those wouldn't destroy a riot shield. All those are is just a sphere of kinetic force and a bunch of shrapnel. That's... That is two things riot shields are designed to stop. Up to a certain point, though, right? Because I think a grenade also produces heat. Yeah, but it... Oh, I guess that depends on the melting point of plexiglass. 
I, I'm no I, expert I, on plexiglass. Neither am I. Okay, so conditionally, perhaps grenades would be able to... Also, I mean... The... No, but the, it was shattered, not melted. If it was melted, that would be one thing. Well, maybe it melted a little bit and got weak. I don't know. It's a video game about ghosts. And here I am complaining about the physics of ballistic shields. Yeah. Fictional ballistic shields. Oh, maybe you're supposed to use that button. What button? The one that's next to the end. Yeah, there. The one that says A on it. I'm trying. Ah, fuck. The or an arrow. On it is not clear. Is the hitbox on people is fucking huge, but. Oh, good. It's this part from Metal Gear that everyone rips off. Where are they? Oh! Huh. Apparently this game is above that. <laughs> but not above being bad. I respect their integrity for not ripping off the elevator bit from Metal Gear. I, I don't respect their game design abilities, though. This seems like something that's made by a student as, like, their final project from school. And I mean, to that end, in 2005, this would have been an impressive final project. Oh, God. If a student makes a first-person shooter from scratch that runs, that is impressive. <laughs> but especially, I like... I thought this was Psycho people. Mantis for a second, the way she bobbed up. Yep. So, you like to play Castlevania. Yeah, it's much better than this game. Thank you very much for noticing. I, I don't care. I don't care, weird ghost person. I don't care who you are, I don't care what era you died in. I just want to leave this place so I don't have to play this game anymore. Look at these guys. They say goons walk in single file to hide their numbers. Those bullets are too accurate for sand goons. That sounds racist. <laughs> sand goons? Yeah, a little bit. Oh man. I remember showing you that picture uh, from 4chan. Um, where it was, uh, this one guy goes on the board and says, uh, I'm an alien from an advanced race, uh, sent to, um, scout out, oh, I could have possessed that, uh, sent to scout out planets for a potential cohabitation by our species. I will answer any question that you want to know about anything if, um, uh, if you will tell me a bit about your planet. And the first response was, fuck off space niggers, we're full. You can crash on the moon if you like, though. And, uh, I think the best reaction to that I've seen is, wouldn't it be amazing if that was actually our first ever interaction with real aliens? Fuck off, space niggers. You can go to the moon, though? <laughs> yeah, uh, because the image of Smug Pepe would be on the front of all of our, like, inter- <laughs> yep. Our, like, alien relationship textbooks <laughs> that children would have to learn from in the future. <laughs> And that was the story about how Pepe represented our race, after being considered a hate symbol. No, this was before that. Yeah, but I mean, if we met aliens, it would be after. Come on, boy, don't Just because honest. Hillary Clinton says something doesn't make it true. In fact, many would say exactly the opposite. Yeah. You know how Rourke is around Doc. Oh, God. Like, I feel sorry for America, because no matter who wins, they lose. 350 million people, and these were the best two they could produce. Whatever happened to that old Jewish guy? Which old Jewish guy? Sanders. Bernie Sanders? Yeah. They didn't vote for him. Yeah, that was the problem. <laughs> Fuck, if he'd run up here, I'd have voted for him. Even though he's a little too socialist, even for my leanings. I don't know, he's but... not as bad as Trudeau's turning out to be. Oh, fuck, yeah. Our that enemies was a... win if we kill them. Yeah. Fuck. See, the major thing we didn't realize about Trudeau... Is that he's a moron? Yeah. See, the entire thing was we were blinded by how much we hated that robot we elected several years ago. Fucking Harper. Yeah, no one... Can I possess you, dog? You need to spook the dog first. This is... Phantom Sleeps. Oh, that's the dog. The dog must be Phantom. The dog's name is Phantom. That seems like a bear... Very... That's on the nose. That seems like a... Oh, possess the dog bull. Can I possess your food? I... Yeah, yeah, yeah! I've seen this. I've seen this, this scare. Okay. It... Come get your food, doggo. Bork? Spook! Okay, I would just like to say for the point of realism, I have never once seen a dog sit by a full dish of food and not eat it. I don't know, my dog back, like, even before she got, like, stomach cancer, sometimes wouldn't eat her food immediately. Like, well then again, dogs don't like dry kibble that much. Ramps for wolves! For dogs. You're like a bloodhound. Hey, boy. 
Thank you. Thank you for breaking so many rules when you know there's a ghost around. <laughs> I'm just an innocent Bang dog, up Bork Bork. Well, dogs can't be possessed. Fuck you, rats. Oh, you oh can... I can spook the rats. You can possess the rats. I'm gonna keep going with Phantom. On the nose, dog. Hey, boy. Ah, boo. Well, at least they don't shoot you. That, that's nice. This is more like Legend of Zelda than, like, other horrible games. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, if the kid's caught wandering around the castle, kick him out. Don't... Well, you know what? It's a kid, right? Yeah, he, he, he was, like, hey, eight by the Se looks he of was it. Fuck off, you're seven. <laughs> yeah, fuck off, you're seven. But, yeah, like, you don't draw and quarter a seven-year-old for breaking into the I palace. think what you're supposed to do is be the rat and then sneak by people because yeah. rats are tiny. You don't, like kill an eight-year-old who sneaks into the palace, you'd, like, yeah. smack him once and then send him on his way. Yeah. Not even that. It might be he was like, oh, you are you want to... Oh, you can't climb. Really? Go check if there's maybe a hole in the wall. Wow, this game is shit. How can the... Oh, oh. yeah. All right. Okay. It's nice to know that you're secure. Jesus Christ. Wait, I... wait, wait. So I couldn't get over that ledge, but this ledge is just fine. Shut up. Game they hard-coded that ledge so that I had to go around. All right, you know what? This game's shit. We'll see you next year. Wait. I want to blow a thing up. All right. Wait till that dude comes back. No. I'm just going to blow it up now. Bye, everybody.